everyone, it's the LEGO Detective, and today I'm coming at you with another beat em on video. Earlier today, I reviewed Bloody Kaiser, and now it's time for another beat em on video, except this time, it's not going to be a review. It's going to be a Let's Build. This is on Go Tiger. So, I reviewed Go Tiger just, I think, like a week ago or so. Um, but I have two Go Tigers, because I ordered recently a few big lots of beat em on, and between those lots, I got two Go Tigers. Now, this Go Tiger is missing a lot of the stickers. The other one that I have actually has all the stickers, and the stickers on this one just keep falling off. Uh, like, when I actually first got this one, it had most of the stickers, but, like, the stickers just keep falling off. So I thought, well, let's do a let's build on Go Tiger since I don't really need this one. It's just kind of an extra that I have, but it still is complete in terms of its parts. So I thought, let's do a let's build. So anyway, we're just going to begin. Rather than starting with the core, I'm going to start with the armor. So I'm just going to scooch this down and just get the armor out of the way first. So yeah, you can just see the feet. Literally, as I was building this, like a bunch of the stickers of the feet just fell off. So <laughs> yeah. Anyway, just, why can't I get it? There we go. Just get the feet. Oh, one of these feet, like the silver feet, one of them is really tight and the other one's really loose. And one of the uh, foot armors is really tight and one of them is really loose. So I have to match up the really loose foot with the tight armor and the really lo loose armor with the tight foot. But yeah, there's the, that. Uh, let's just peg in the shoulder armor. There we go. Just quickly doing all that. There we go. And then the head. When I was taking it apart, it took me like a long time to get this headpiece off. I'm not sure why, but it's a really tight fit right there. And then take the visor. There we go. It's pretty simple. The core will take a little bit more fiddling with to get that. And uh, yeah, there's the head. Snap on that little rubber horn and seal the deal with this final piece. And there we go, there's the head, uh, it, missing all of its stickers and all of its glory. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to set these off to, for now. And now let's get into the core. So we're going to start with this low. Actually, no, we're going to start with uh, the trigger. So this spike goes up, if I'm not mistaken. So that's what I'm going to start with. Uh, okay, how should I start? Okay, well, let's start by doing this. Let's just put this in like so. And then I didn't take out the drive strip because it's a really small piece and I didn't want to lose it or something. Because that would completely ruin the performance of the beat -em on Okay, so got that. Okay, so now we got to take this, put it in there. And then take this little piece and... There we go. Okay, and now we're just gonna slide this. There we go. There we go. Slide that into place. And then that's gonna be the mechanism there. That's what it's gonna be like. Alright, so we start this back there. This is gonna be pretty tricky, just getting these little gears in. There we go. I've actually uh, disassembled this and done this once before. That's how I know how to assemble this. Yesterday, or, no, it was two days ago. I just disassembled it. Okay, so this should mean that when we push it. Yeah, that looks like about right. Oh, wait a sec. Okay, error right there. It's pretty tricky to get those little gears aligned. There we go. Hopefully this is it. Okay, and then I'm just gonna hold everything nice and sturdy. And then carefully just snap this on. Okay, let's see. Did we get it? I think we did. Alright, let's just... I have a Bidama with me here. Let's just test it. And yes, we got it. I really got to clean off this white sheet of paper here. Okay, so we got that. Then just take these little pieces and slide them on the sides right there. And there we go. There's the short stroke drive core. Uh, I don't, uh, 
like I said, I think it was yesterday. No, it it was two days. Yeah, it, yes, yeah. Ugh. Sorry, it was two days ago when I disassembled this and reassembled it. It was much harder. It took me like five minutes to reassemble it because I messed up with the gears. Right, let's just try that one more time. And yes, it does look like it is working. Uh, okay, so now if I don't lose the Vidama, <laughs> let's pop on the feet. Just like so, and then the head, and then we get these super thick uh, pieces right there to hold on the head. And most of the other Zero Two System Beat'em on, they're not really thick; they're really thin, and they have records of breaking. But these are super thick and super durable. So if you're making like a compet, like if you're trying to make a competitive combo with like a Zero Two System. I recommend you get Go Tigers to get those really thick little rings so that the core doesn't break or uh, the head doesn't fall off because they break. But anyway, just because it's good to hold uh, hold it onto your core. But anyway, yeah, there's Go Tiger. This is like only six minutes, like a little over six minutes. So it's pretty crazy that I was able to build it that fast. But oh, and another sticker just fell off. Yay. <laughs> Look at that, it was just like the sticker from up there just fell right off. So, you know what I might want to do? I might just want to remove all the stickers. Some of these other ones are like these, and then this one, they just don't want to come off. That's the thing. Anyway, though, <laughs> uh, there is my Let's Build of Go Tiger. I hope that you enjoyed it. Uh, and, yeah, it's kind of an interesting system. Uh, but anyway, thanks for watching, guys. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. Bye.